Hello everyone, welcome to Simple Trading Style and today we are going to talk about daily crypto market update and we will figure out is it bearish trend or what's going on with the crypto world. Let's move. Please subscribe for the YouTube channel and click like button to support the channel. I really appreciate it. Let's move to trading view. Trading view. Uh, crypto heat map, daily performance, all red and gray, all red and gray. Let's move to charts. We're going to talk about charts. Uh, let's start Bitcoin, a yeah, daily time frame for entry and exit position for swing trading. I'm using four hours and daily time frame. <clears throat> if you want to learn more about uh, trading view setup, just go to, to the description. There is the link about trading view setup training and other links about all my trainings. You can learn it very quickly. And subscribe for the channel and you will follow the, my daily updates. You will learn it from, from my updates very easy, very easy. And remember, it's not, uh, it's very simple, but it's not easy because of your emotions as well. The trading is easy. Complication is the trader, emotions of the trader. And remember, we follow the trend like here, market change direction, sell signal. It is bearish reversal signal. For us, it's, we change from bullish to bearish. That's how it works. No, don't fight with the market. Don't predict the market. Just follow the market. Okay, let me briefly mention about my setup. I'm using moving averages, white line MA200, yellow line MA20, red line MA10, green line MA5, MACD indicator, green line bullish, red line bearish, white line signal line, RSI indicator, uh, yellow line, Heikonaichi indicator, green line bullish, green bars bullish, red bars bearish. That's all, very simple. Let's start, just three indicators, volume also, but I do monitor volume, but I, I don't trade anything on the volume. Let's start daily time frame Bitcoin plus half percent today. Look at it for last five days. It's dancing around the same price action. Didn't move anywhere. It's kind of bare flag. MACD is still bearish at the zero line. RSI the oversold territory, close to oversold territory, Heikonachi bearish. Bearish trend on, four, on daily time frame for Bitcoin. Let's move to 4 hours time frame to see. 4 hours time frame, last bar, very powerful, very powerful move. Some good news. 300 points it moved, it moved, it touched the mate 20. We'll see, it did touch the mate 20 before and it was rejected. We'll see, will it be rejected or it will continue to move up. A positive note, MA5 ready for bullish crossover, MACD green bullish, Heikonachi green bullish. On 4 hours time frame, it has some positive signal, but buy signal. But remember, all moving averages below 200, it is still negative bearish position. Negative bearish position, but temporary signal is positive. Usually it's a fake. When it's in the, in the negative territory, it could be bull trap. Big bull trap. Okay, one hour time frame. It's a similar positive positive uh, buy signal. MA5 did, MA2, 5 did bullish crossover over 10 and 20. Bullish signal. MACD bullish. Heikonachi green bullish. RSI all indicators bullish on one hour time frame. Let's move to Bitcoin Cash. Bitcoin Cash daily. Let's see Bitcoin Cash daily. Bitcoin Cash Daily. Uh, sell signal on the script. It stopped at MA200. You look at it for last five days. It stopped at MA200. Today it's the first day that moved below 200, but it came back still about the same level, minus 1% so far. Still bearish trend. Let's see, MA200 can be strong support line it can bounce from it it can easy bounce from it because it was for five days at the support line macd red bearish hikonachi red bearish rsi in the bearish oversold territory bearish signal bearish trend let's move to four hours four hours similar story 
still bearish for last yeah last four bars at the same price action but still bearish below all moving averages all volume averages below 200 below white line it is bearish negative territory MACD bearish it has some bullish divergences like I told you yesterday price action is still downtrend MACD building bullish divergences MACD has bullish uptrend histogram and MACD uh, lines also uptrend RSI bullish divergence but RSI in the oversold territory Heikonachi is still bearish red MACD red bearish bearish trend on all indicators with bullish divergences on four hours time frame one hour time frame still bearish trend by signal but still bearish it just it just moved to touch the May 20 MACD green bullish Heikonachi green bullish positive signal still bearish trend but positive signal on one hour time frame let me let me minimize it you see it's below MA200 200 downtrend MA20 downtrend when moving average is downtrend it is bearish trend for bullish trend we need a moving average is move uptrend and we need to bring MA20 above 200 so far it's still bearish trend with, with the uh, short term one hour buy signal Ethereum let's move to Ethereum Ethereum minus quarter percent down almost flat similar story for last five days it's the same price action same price level bearish trend bearish divergences on all indicators bearish trend on MACD on Heikonachi on RSI daily time frame Ethereum bearish let's move to four hours time frame similar story MA20 yellow line did bearish crossover over 200 it is negative territory bearish trend bearish divergences uh, actually it has bullish divergences look at it price action downtrend right and uh, let me show you MACD is uptrend MACD uptrend MACD histogram let's let me show you histogram is uptrend bullish divergence but uh, when ma20 yellow line did bearish crossover it is very negative it is very negative macd still be yeah green bar macd green green line it is bullish i can actually green bar bullish but trend still bearish trend still bearish signal temporary signal is bullish but trend still bearish with bullish divergences rsi has bullish divergence also you see price action is downtrend rsi is uptrend ethereum is oversold and it wants to have some correction but remember our divergences can stay for a long time one hour time frame it's a bounce bullish signal same similar like here like like channel right channel downtrend channel bullish signal on one hour time frame all on all indicators ethereum classic ethereum classic minus half percent today let's see daily time frame sell signal i made all moving averages below 200 now it's a bearish trend for last six days it, it, it dancing around the same level macd red bearish i can actually red bearish rsi near to oversold territory nothing changed on daily time frame four hours it is still bearish trend all moving averages below 200 it's a bearish territory similar similar like ethereum price action is downtrend uh, macd bullish macd bullish rsi bullish bullish divergences on all indicators right but trend still bearish trend still bearish on four hours time frame let's let's move to one one hour for ethereum classic one hour to ethereum classic buy signal bullish for last three bars it's a bullish signal macd bullish 
Hai ca n-ai ce bolish are să ai bolish. Bolish on one hour time frame. It bounces from the bottom. We'll see how far it will go. So far, like I said, like for Ethereum, you see white line MA200 is downtrend. MA20 downtrend. All moving averages downtrend. And MA20 below 200, it is bearish territory, downtrend territory, bearish trend direction. It has some bullish divergences on all indicators on 4 hours and daily and 4 hours and 1 hour time frame, but trend is still bearish. Other Cardano flat flat today, no changes. Daily time frame. Same bearish trend on moving averages, sell signal on the script, last five days, same price action, MACD red bearish. Volume is not high. Volume is kind of you know, for last four days is flat low. High Kanachi red RSI bearish. All indicators bearish on daily time frame. Let's move to uh, four hours time frame. Similar story. All moving averages below 200, below white line. It is bearish trend, bearish territory, bearish negative position. May CD green positive. Bullish divergence is similar story like other crypto, right? Price action is downtrend. Let's see. Price action is downtrend. MACD uptrend. MACD histogram uptrend. RSI uptrend. So bullish divergences, multiple bullish divergences like on all indicators. It means the crypto is oversold. It wants to have some correction but it takes some time one hour four hours time frame it's a bearish one hour time frame it has bullish signal buy signal on the script and if i get bullish crossover over 10 and 20 it is bullish run macd green bullish high Kanachi green bullish rsi bullish all indicators bullish on one hour time frame let's do summary let's do summary crypto in the same trend direction nothing changed bearish direction on daily time frame all crypto from my watch list on the same bearish trend direction on four hours time frame also bearish all crypto bearish but they already built some bullish divergences bullish divergences they built on some indicators like let me show you like bitcoin right price action is Downtrend, downtrend, and MACD uptrend. MACD, high Kanachi, you see RSI uptrend. MACD uptrend. Same for all crypto. They all, they are all building bullish divergences, and moving averages below 200. It is negative bearish territory for all cryptos. That's what we observe. It's a bearish on 4 hours on daily time frame and kind of positive on 1 hour time frame. It, 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 it wants to have some correction because it, it's very oversold on RSI and on 1 hour time frame it has some bullish positive signal. That's all. Thank you so much. Let's move to disclaimer. I'm not a financial advisor. This video for educational informational purposes only. Please read it. And remember, for educational purpose, we are using paper trading account. Thank you for watching simple trading style video. I do publish daily updates for stocks, ETFs, indexes, and cryptos. Please subscribe for YouTube channel and click like button to support the channel. I really appreciate all your efforts. Thank you so much and good luck. Bye now.